Hello friends on the last videos we have learned how to navigate between activities and how to pass a value between activities while navigating so we we are open to the same project which we discussed on the last uh, video so in this project on the main activity we can uh, pass a string type a string it will be passing to the next activity i mean the second activity so in this video we are discussing about one back pressed function so how we override a back function when we click the back button what will happen so we can uh, if we want to override so we can use this function without wasting any time let's go to the video okay so open the second activity here on the last we can override back button so here we can write on back pressed so the function is came so here we can do the coding so i am just putting just finish only so it will destroy the activity so suppose see you can see the sdk version is the 32 if you change this to 33 to the latest what will happen let's see so till now till the 32 it, we were using this on back press the function see it is deprecated on the 33 onwards it is deprecated so what is the an alternative now either you can change there to 32 or here you can change 32 or learn how the alternative for alternative of on back pressed now onwards on the 33 onwards will be like this so let's learn for the new alternative so on back pressed so here you can type while on back pressed call back is equal to object colon on back pressed call back we can enable it by default and insert the curly bracket just click here and implement here you can code what is you want to code while clicking the back button i'm just putting one toast only because in your case it can be different according to your project demands so for a demonstration i just putting one toast and it will show you when we click the back button it will it will show you just by only especially if you are uh, using a uh, any type of music music player then it is mandatory to stop while you clicking on the back button otherwise even you even after you click the back button the music will continue to play and here type on back press dispatcher dot add call back then call the on back press to call back now just run the project and we'll see how it is coming is working or not so now let's type one uh, value here because we are using on the previous project only so just click next activity activity now it is the value passed here see now we are on the second activity just to put the back button and you can see click the back button 
see the by post is appeared that's it this method we will work even if you are using the gesture wise back button so i hope this video is informative and thank you for viewing